seniors, they don't know about it. Cody Stark live in Antelope. Hi there. Okay, seniors, gather around, gather around. I want to see some emotion. I want to see some thankfulness for these teachers. You guys ready? Hit it. Titans on three, red one, two, three. Titans! Hey. Everett, okay, why do you want to surprise Mrs. Akamoto? Because she was one of my favorite teachers coming into Olive Grove, and she was one of the first teachers that impacted me as a kid. Okay, here we go. Go, go, man. Go, 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 go. Hello, good morning to you. How are you doing? We have a special message that Everett wanted to say something. Oh, hi, Everett. Hi, Ms. Akamoto. You, you may need this. Hold on to that. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Dear Miss Okamoto, my name is Everett Campbell and I graduate on May 27th. Thank you for being such a positive impact on me at such a young and early stage in my life. I remember when we used to go to PE with all the big kids and we used to race them and even though I was a little nervous about them at the time, you kept encouraging me to go over there. I remember when I finally went over there and started to fit in, you were so proud of me and I will never forget. Although it may not seem like a lot, it meant the world to me and even though I don't remember a lot about kindergarten, I remember kindergarten was one of the happiest times of my life and a lot of that was because of you. I thank you for leaving a positive mark on me at such a young early age in my life and it's something I will never forget. Thank you for helping to shape into the young man I am today. Always Everett Campbell. I'm so Aww. proud of you. <laughs> I was just telling them that you used to beat all the second graders when you were in kindergarten because you were so fast. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think of that? It's amazing. It's so I'm so proud of him. I'm Thank so you. proud of him. I remember I just told Mr. Danini when when we saw him out there, I was like, that's Everett Campbell. We used to race the second graders and in kindergarten he used to beat all of them. <laughs> kindergarten teachers never forget, man. Yeah. No, never no, forget. No. Yeah. Everett, what was it about her that, that really stuck in your mind? Because you could have done this for any teacher. Yeah, um, I don't know. She was just probably the first teacher that just encouraged me to be a positive person and to just always be nice to others and to always just respect others and try to just be yourself no matter who you're around and to just she was just always a positive person and always put a smile on my face you did that you did that congratulations that's very sweet nice to meet you nice to meet you you're a great teacher you. i'm hearing all these teachers here was talking about how great you are so you're Thank wonderful you. wonderful lady. all right Back to you guys in the studio there. We've got some tissues to go through. Oh We're going to cry together here in a second. Seriously. To you, right? See, that's what teachers live for, right? They always wonder if they Thanks had an impact or what yeah. the kids, if the kids even remember who they were.